gonna be kind of a busy day i have to run a few errands i'm like running out of my cushion but yeah i'm gonna be getting my nails removed today and i'm gonna be getting them done again and then i'm finally gonna get some clear prescribed contacts because I ran out like so long ago and I'm also gonna try taking an Instagram picture today because I haven't posted on my Instagram in so long this whole summer I feel like I've just been like slacking on my Instagram because I've been really lazy to like take pictures so I haven't really posted in almost like a month I moved to my desk for now because the lighting's better here I start uni in like almost a week now and I don't really know how to feel about that I feel like summer just flew by and I'm not really ready to go to university like I low-key just want to stay where I am right now. You know those bad mascara days where your lashes just don't curl or like stay up? I'm having one of those today. It took me so long to come up with an outfit today. I don't know why, but lately I've been struggling so much with like coming up with outfits to wear before I leave the house. This shirt is from Zaffle. I like never wear this shirt. I think this is my very first time wearing this shirt out. And then these pants are from Princess Polly. These pants make my legs look so long. I'm also gonna pack this dress because I have to take Instagram pictures later. And this is from YesStyle. So I am currently at Staples and I'm gonna be looking for like back to school stuff because I still haven't gone back to school shopping and uni is starting soon. into this like completely different outfit because i have to take some instagram pictures before my nail appointment which is at six right now it's 5 23 so i have like a good 30 minutes i have to change in the car and i also changed my shoes and i have this bag as a prop for my pictures oh my god i have like lipstick on my nose but yeah hopefully the pictures turn out decent i'm at the nail salon now and this time i'm not gonna get like fake nails they're so like inconvenient to have when they like grow out i'm just gonna get like designs on my actual nails as you can see my nails are so like crusty now because they're so grown out i've had these for like a month now back home and today was such a long day but yeah i just remembered i didn't show you guys my nails properly yet these are the nails that i got and i'm obsessed with them i showed this picture of jenny's nails for the reference of the designs i'm also gonna do a really quick haul of stuff that i got i'm not gonna show anything that i got from staples because i feel like you guys already saw what i got when i was like filming the clips when i was shopping first of all i got this backpack from muji i've always been needing a new backpack because i've been using the same jansport bag during my four years of high school so i figured for university i needed a new backpack and i saw this one on muji and it's so my style it's so cute it's like that tote bag color just imagine me going to school with this bag <laughs> then i got this from aritzia it's just this like collared sweater thing and i thought it was really cute and gave off like preppy vibes as you guys know i love aritzia sweaters so and this one is so soft and comfortable lastly i got some sweat shorts and these are also from aritzia i've been needing a pair of sweat shorts for a really long time so i finally got them and i've been wearing these out a lot they're so comfortable Oh, 
So I just finished catching up with Penthouse, but now I have to do something for university. We have to do some mandatory modules for like academic integrity and it's mandatory and due tomorrow. I had so much time, but of course I left it till the last minute. It's 11.43 p.m. right now. Today was just a really like unproductive day because I did wake up at like 2 because the past two days I went out with my friends and going out just made me so like drained and tired. So today I stayed in bed for like the whole day and didn't do anything. Yesterday I went to an amusement park with my friends. When I came home, my legs and feet hurt so much and I think it was extra painful because I went out the day before that again and went to Toronto with my friends and we walked around like the whole day. So for the past two days, I've just been like walking around so much. That was just a little update. Oh my god, my face looks so... So bad right now. I don't know why, but I have like the worst discoloration around my mouth. I also have an orientation tomorrow for my university and it's at 8 a.m. And it's online, which sucks because I seriously don't get why my school can't just like do stuff in person. <laughs> doing my university modules right now and it's currently 1 16 a.m right now i'm gonna have this snack even though it's 1 a.m and i shouldn't be eating too late <laughs> Hi guys, so it is the next day and I just finished taking some Instagram pictures and I just posted them That took way too long. Like I don't know why these days I just can't take pictures like they never turn out the way that I want them to but a couple days ago in the vlog I tried to take some Instagram pictures I didn't end up posting those so that's why I had to take some new ones today because I didn't like the ones that I took that time I have plans in a couple of hours But before I go out, I'm gonna be cleaning my makeup brushes because I don't think I've ever cleaned them in my life And that's like kind of gross you can see there are all just here i actually bought this like kit for cleaning your makeup brushes it's super cool it's like i saw this at marshall so i decided to get it i also got this makeup brush cleanser since this brush is my blush brush the cleanser is kind of turning like pink I just finished cleaning all of my brushes Me and my friend are gonna go and get some piercings right now It was so random and very last minute Right now I only have double piercings on each ear I used to have a cartilage piercing right here and another one here But I took both of them out because they both were like so infected I don't really know if it's like the smartest choice to get another piercing after that happened Because I just never have like good luck with piercings I think today i'm gonna get one right here I'm also thinking of getting a tragus which is right here, but I heard that one's kind of painful. So i'm not too sure So bleeding. Mm -hmm. 
So I am back home and I forgot to show you guys the piercings properly after I got them done. I got my tragus and my mid helix pierced. I actually got the mid helix re-pierced because I got it pierced like two years ago. It did close because it was infected so I had to take it out last year. And then I've always wanted my tragus pierced. I was honestly kind of scared today because I heard that the tragus piercing is more painful compared to other ones. And it's like a really hard and long healing process but i decided to get it anyways and i'm so glad i did because i love how it looks it's so pretty it was kind of painful when i got it pierced but it was like tolerable but after i got it pierced it actually hurt a lot like the hour after i got it pierced it was kind of like throbbing but after that like when i got to the restaurant it stopped hurting and now like i don't really feel it i felt like i needed some kind of change before going to uni so getting two piercings helped with that i actually had a helix piercing right here but it also closed because it was infected. I got it in like grade 8. So that was like almost 4 years ago. But that's why I have like a weird bump on my ear. So I changed into my pajamas. And I realized that I didn't show some things when I did the haul a couple days ago in this vlog. And I also got some new things. So I'm going to be showing you guys right now. First we have this mechanical keyboard. And I showed this in my room transformation video. And you also probably saw this in other clips of this vlog. So I'm basically pretending to unbox it right now just to show you guys for the video. So many people ask me where I got this keyboard, so I'm going to be linking it in the description box. I'm so glad I got this because the clicking sounds are so satisfying and I love like the feeling of the keyboard. For now, I plug it into my MacBook, but I might get like a monitor or a PC. There's so many different settings of the keyboard. You can click here and... There's like so many options. I like to keep it at the one where it lights up every time you type on it. The next item that I'm gonna show you guys are these pajamas from Muji. I've been looking for these pajamas for so long. I've seen these pajamas around and I thought they were so cute, but I could never find them and they were like never available at Muji. But I finally found them. They were pretty pricey. This is so cute and I can't wait to wear it when it gets colder. The last thing that I got is some manga. I got Toilet Bound Volume 7. When I went to Toronto with my friends the other day, we went to some manga store and they had it. So I had to get it. I've actually been looking for any volume of toilet bound because i love the manga and i got lucky because this is one of my favorite volumes i'm obsessed with the art and then i have two volumes of bungo stray dogs and my friend actually got these for me and i'm so excited to read it these volumes are like way after the anime ends off so i'm so excited i don't think i showed this in any of my videos but i also have another bungo stray dogs volume and i got this one off of amazon a month or like two months ago i mainly got it because of the cover and it's also one of my favorite parts of bungo stray dogs 